Caligula, the third Roman emperor, is often referred to as the Mad Emperor due to his notorious reign of terror, excess, and cruelty. His story has become a popular subject in history books, movies, and TV shows, as it serves as a cautionary tale of the dangers of absolute power and the consequences of unchecked ambition. In this article, we will delve into the dark side of Caligula's reign, exploring his infamous cruelty, extravagance, and sexual depravity. We will also examine the historical context that led to his rise to power and the political and social implications of his rule. Caligula, the Roman emperor who ruled from 37 to 41 AD, is often remembered as one of the most notorious and insane rulers in history. His reign was marked by cruelty, extravagance, and excess, as he indulged in his every whim and desire. In this article, we will explore the dark side of Caligula's reign and the reasons behind his infamous reputation. We will examine his childhood, his rise to power, his reign of terror, and his eventual downfall. Childhood and Early Life Caligula was born in 12 AD, the third son of the popular Roman general Germanicus and his wife Agrippina the Elder. His birth name was Gaius Julius Caesar, but he was given the nickname Caligula, meaning little boot because he often wore miniature military boots as a child. Caligula's childhood was marked by tragedy, as his father died in 19 AD and his mother was exiled in 29 AD, leaving him and his siblings in the care of their grandmother Antonia. Caligula's upbringing was also marked by exposure to the brutality and corruption of the Roman elite. His great-uncle Tiberius, who became emperor after the death of Caligula's grandfather Augustus, was notorious for his cruelty and depravity, and Caligula was often a witness to his excesses. It is said that Tiberius had a swimming pool filled with young boys and girls whom he would rape and torture, and Caligula was reportedly present at these events. Rise to Power In 37 AD, Tiberius died and was succeeded by his grandnephew Caligula, who was just 25 years old. At first, Caligula was a popular ruler known for his generosity and willingness to engage with the common people. He also reversed some of Tiberius's unpopular policies, such as the ban on public trials. However, Caligula's reign soon took a darker turn. He became increasingly paranoid and erratic, and began to indulge in his every whim and desire. He appointed his favorite horse, Incitatus, as a consul and had him housed in a marble stable with a staff of servants. He also began to demand that he be worshipped as a god, and had statues of himself erected throughout the empire. Reign of Terror Caligula's reign of terror began in earnest in 39 AD, when he fell seriously ill and became convinced that he was the victim of a conspiracy. He began to order the execution of anyone he suspected of disloyalty, including members of his own family. He had his cousin and rival Tiberius Gemellus executed, as well as his own wife and daughter. Caligula's cruelty and extravagance knew no bounds. He built lavish palaces and engaged in reckless spending, causing financial turmoil in the empire. He also engaged in incestuous relationships with his sisters, Drusilla and Lavilla, and was rumored to have committed acts of sexual depravity with both men and women. Caligula's reputation for madness and cruelty spread throughout the empire and he was the subject of numerous assassination plots. In 41 AD, a group of disgruntled members of the Praetorian Guard, the elite soldiers who protected the emperor, assassinated Caligula in his palace. His reign of terror had come to an end. Legacy Caligula's legacy is a mixed one. On the one hand, he is remembered as one of the most notorious and insane rulers in history a madman who indulged in his every whim and desire and committed acts of unspeakable cruelty. On the other hand, he is also remembered as a ruler who tried to engage with the common people and who reversed some of Tiberius's unpopular policies. He was also known for his ambitious building projects, including the construction of a new port at Ostia and the renovation of the palace on the Palatine Hill. However, it is his reign of terror that has overshadowed these achievements. Caligula's cruelty, extravagance, and sexual depravity have become the stuff of legend, and he is often held up as an example of the dangers of absolute power. His reign also highlighted the fragility of the Roman political system, 
as his erratic behavior and lack of political experience led to chaos and instability in the empire.